Hello students. Today I am going to start one minute series. Try to solve these questions with me. Often paper setters will frame tough questions. They will try to make you panic and they will try to make you upset. But if you try to catch the logic in these tough questions, then you will get answers very easily. So let's go through these tough questions, which are going to have easy answers. If you want more videos, go to the playlist One Minute Series J and Neat. Now I am going to take previous year's questions. So here we have a circuit. In this circuit, we need to find current through the ammeter. So here you can see we have two 10 ohm resistors, two 10 ohm resistors, and two 10 ohm resistors, and crossed 50 ohm resistors. Now consider this as point A, potential A. Now the same potential will be carried here and here. This is potential A and this is potential A. There is no, as there is no resistor here. Now if you consider this as potential B, this is also potential B. Because whatever current passes through this, as you can see, these are equal resistors. Whatever current passes through this, same amount of current will pass through this. So there will be same potential drop here and here. So this is also potential B and this is also potential B. Now, this resistor is between the same potential. Potential difference is zero, it means no current will pass through this. So, now if you consider this as potential C, this is also potential C because here we have same resistors. Same amount of current will pass through this. Now, this, this resistor is in between same potential. So, potential difference is zero, no current is going to pass through this. So, this is ineffective. Now, the circuit will change into we have 3 10 ohm resistors this is 10 and this is 10 this is 10 this is 10 and this is also 10 so 3 10 ohm resistors in series 3 10 ohm resistors in series now this is 30 and this is 30 so 30 and 30 they are in parallel so when two equal resistors are in parallel then net resistance will be r by 2 15 ohms so net resistance is 15 ohms net resistance is 15 ohms now current through the ammeter i is v upon r net v is given as 6 upon 15 so this is the answer 6 by 15 amperes is the answer so you can see it's very easy just we have we have taken the logic here just we need to catch the logic here so that logic is nothing but these two resistors are between same potential so potential difference is zero 